Meanwhile, back in Marwin Call, the SS took me, they tied me up, then started cutting me. I put a scar down my face because this side was damaged in real life. Mark Hogenkamp was in a bar, and a group of five individuals beat him senseless and did some pretty bad damage to his brain. When the teenagers kicked my head to pieces, they wiped all memory of everything. Well, what's the first thing I gotta work on? That's my imagination. Everything's real. The slide on the 45, the clip even comes out. I'm sorry. Everybody has a dream. Everybody wishes they had a double that could do the things that they could never do. There's always something going on in Marlon Cult. I've taken place in many battles. We usually come out on top. The SS had me tied up. The girls went into the church. They eliminated the SS. Her coming and saving me proved to me that she loved me. So this is my wife, Anna. Anna's competition is Deja Thoris, the Belgian witch of Marlon Cult. And this is Deja Thoris's time machine. First saw Mark, he's in his full World War II regalia. I go, hey, how's it going? What's that all about? I was just astonished by the realism and the feeling. I felt like it was too amazing to not share with other people. There's a curator of an art gallery that wants to display my photos. What if this leads to tension and it's bad for him? Will he make it to the city? It's like this is the one last thing that I don't ever want taken from me. I built Marwin Call for me, for my therapy. It gets stranger by the moment, doesn't it?